barely two weeks after Moscow illegally claimed the annexation of Kherson, and evacuations have already begun. Russian officials on Thursday urged citizens of the strategic region to flee towards southern Ukraine, as Kyiv continues to break the front lines. Following the address of the head of Ukraine's Kherson region, Vladimir Saldo, the Russian government has taken the decision to organize assistance to people leaving the region for other regions of the country. We will provide everyone with free accommodation and everything necessary. Those who will decide to stay permanently at their new place will be provided with a home. The first arrival of evacuees has already been reported in Russia's Rostov region, while others have made their way to the occupied Crimean Peninsula. Despite heavy bombing by Moscow, like here in the nearby city of Mykolaiv, five more Kherson localities have reportedly been retaken by Ukrainian forces. And the latest barrage of Russian strikes across the country has done little to dampen the morale of Ukraine's troops. The fact that they left the shells and scattered only some of the powder shows that they fled very quickly. If we move quickly, there will be many losses. We don't have to hurry, but we need to crush them until the end. For Moscow, meanwhile, a propaganda effort is underway to firm up support back home. Here in Zaporizhia, well-equipped pro-Russian fighters have been filmed preparing for combat. But until the hundreds of thousands of reservists mobilized by Moscow become operational, Kyiv will seek to retain its renewed momentum as it pushes its counter-offensive on the southern front.